So today we are on the seventh uh, lace pattern. Okay. So let's start. I have already done three repeat. Okay. So the fourth one, I'm going to do this tutorial for the fourth one. Okay. So let's start. And I'm sure by now you know, like, you know the knit along for this lace pattern. So I'm not going to uh, uh, add more or say you know more, more details. So we cast on 44 stitches, 40 for the uh, body and 4 for the edging. So let's start with, this is row number 1 for the pattern repeat. So knit 2 for the edging, yarn over, knit 1, yarn over. So this is S, slip, slip, knit. And then pass the slip stitch over. Okay, so we can say S S S K. Okay, so three S and then K. Okay. <coughs> then or we can say the left slanting, uh, two two stitch decrease. And then knit four. Okay, one more time, yarn over, knit one, this is the repeat, yarn over, and then we can say, like, you know, we can do like a, all this and then knit three together through the back loop. But I prefer doing it like slip two stitches, knit the third one, and then pass the slip stitch over. I find this more convenient. And then knit four, okay. That's it, pattern repeat, yarn over, knit one, yarn over, slip two, slip one, as if to knit, slip second, as if to knit, then knit the third one, then pass the slip stitches over, knit four, one, two, three, and four. Yarn over, knit one yarn over slip two stitches as if to knit knit the third one pass the slip stitches over and then knit four yarn over knit one yarn over slip two stitches as if to knit and then knit the third one pass the st slip stitch over and then knit four we complete the pattern repeat for row number one of the pattern turn the work row number two okay for the edging we do knit two and then we'll do p7 one two three four five six and seven and the last one k1 so this is the pattern repeat okay p7 k1 one two three four five six seven and then k1 one two three four five six seven k1 one two three, four, five, six, seven, K1, one, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven and t one. So for the edge, d two. Turn the work. We are at row number three. Okay. So for the edging, knit two. And then he will do p one. Yarn over. Knit one. Yarn over. Knit one. And then slip two stitches. As it to knit. Knit the third one. Pass the slip stitches. And then K2. So this is the pattern repeat. P1, yarn over K1, yarn over K1, knit three together. And then knit two. Repeat the pattern, P1 yarn over p1 yarn over p1 knit three together and knit two repeat the pattern p1 yarn over k1 yarn over k1 p3 together Oh, sorry, K3 together. K2. I don't know I was whether I was saying P or K. <laughs> I was lost in my thought for some time. Okay, so last repeat. Uh, P1, yarn over K1, yarn over K1, and then K3 together, but we do it slip two stitches as if to knit. Knit the third one, pass the slip stitches over, knit two, that's it. And for the edging, K2. Then the work, and we are at row number four, the wrong side. So we'll do again for the edging, K2. And then we'll do P7, K1. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, and then K1. Repeat P7 K1. Okay, for the edging, knit two. Turn the work. We are at row number five. Knit two for the edging. P one. Knit one, yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit two, and then slip two stitches as if to knit, and then knit the third stitch, pass the slip stitch over. So it's like knit three together, okay? The same. P1, K1, yarn over, K1, yarn over, K2 and then we do 
slip slip knit and pass over repeat p1 knit one yarn over knit one yarn over knit two slip two stitches as if to knit knit the third one pass the slip stitches over repeat p1 k1 yarn over k1 yarn over k2 slip two stitches as if to knit knit the third one pass the slip stitches over repeat last repeat p1 k1 yarn over k1 yarn over k2 slip the two stitches as if to knit knit the third one pass the slip stitches over and then knit two for the edge turn the work and we are at row number six and it is the same one so we do two for the edging then we do purl seven and then knit one okay p7 k1 is the repeat Okay, then for the edging, need knit two. Turn the work. Then we are at row number seven. For the edging, knit two. Then we do. P1 and knit 3, 1, 2 and 3, then we do knit 3 together, okay, so we do knit 3 together, and then yarn over, knit 1 and yarn over, so this is the pattern repeat we are going to do, so first is P1, K3 knit 3 together yarn over knit 1 and yarn over so repeat P1 K3 knit 3 together yarn over knit 1 and then yarn over repeat p1 k3 knit three together yarn over knit one yarn over repeat p1 k3 knit three together yarn over knit one yarn over and for the edging knit two 
and that's it done the work we added row number eight so again the same for the back back side or the wrong side knit two for the edging and we'll do purl seven two three four five six seven and then knit one so repeat one two three four five six seven knit one one two three four five six seven knit one one two three four five six seven knit one one two three four five six seven knit one and for the edging knit two done the work we are at row number nine knit two for the edging then purl one knit one knit three together k1 yarn over k1 yarn over k1 so this is the pattern repeat p1 k1 k3 together k1 yarn over k1 yarn over and k1 repeat one more time p1 k1 k3 together k1 yarn over k1 yarn over and k1 repeat p1 k1 k3 together k1 yarn over k1 yarn over k1 repeat p1 k1 k3 together k1 yarn over k1 yarn over and k1 for the edging k2 turn the work then we are at row number 10 so for row number 10 knit 2 for the edging and then we'll purl all or say purl the last two stitches okay
for the edging need to turn the work we are at row number 11 so knit two for the edging knit three together knit two yarn over knit one yarn over knit two so this is the pattern repeat knit three together knit two yarn over knit one yarn over and knit two repeat the pattern knit three together knit two yarn over knit one yarn over and knit two repeat again knit three together knit two yarn over knit one yarn over and knit two last repeat knit three together knit two yarn over knit one yarn over and knit two then for the edging knit two turn the work so this is the last row for the pattern and it is knit all at the back so for the edging sorry purl all at the back knit two and then we'll purl till the last two stitches Okay, and for the edging, knit two. So we are done with all the repeats, and the last two row is knit all. Okay, so I'm still enjoying uh, creating or patterns with uh, eight stitch repeat and 12 rows let's continue it uh, for you know, as long as we are enjoying it so you can see this is from yesterday let's do a review of what we have done so far okay and then this is from day before yesterday okay so these are all you know uh, leftovers from my previous projects I mean the yarn okay and then we have this and we started with this one okay so happy knitting guys let's uh, meet again tomorrow